right, y'all. Customizing a 44 glove today. Hey, let's go to this, huh? Custom gloves. Let's do it. Baseball, obviously. Infield. We got to go with the crown tip. Short King got to have his crown, you know what I'm saying? 11.25 for show. Logo style. Let's see here. Embroidered looks pretty clean. We'll go with that one. Lace length. Let's see. Do we want the long, long laces? Probably not. Give that boy a haircut. I think I will add the palm liner because nobody likes a stinger to the palm. So let's freaking thicken that boy up wrist lining definitely going with the moisture wicking performance wrist pad you know why the fur is nice at first okay but after a few months of playing with the fur wrist liners after a while it feels like you're shoving your hand in a sheep's anus the web style okay i web i like the traditional i web i web spiral lace Got a couple little dreadlocks going on your web there. That looks pretty freaking cool. Y web, meh. E web, H web, mm, too many. Too many lines. Tic tac toe on the shit. V web, that's kind of like the E web, but a little split action going on. The mod V web, that's looking pretty slick, if I do say so myself. E, nah, net, nah. Basket, mm, nah, nah. Nope. Crossweb, nah. Too many laces. No, no, nah. Mm, diamond, nah. Helix, hmm, that's interesting. Spearweb, whoa, these are works of art down here. One piece full web, just a slab of leather on that bad boy. Mm, no thanks. I think we're gonna go with the modified V web. That's looking pretty friggin' slick, my guy. Glove stiffness. Um, let's see. Do I want it fully erect? Or do I want it a little bit flaccid? I'm probably going to go a little flaccid. Because I'm trying to use the thing like as soon as possible. So, yeah. I, I, don't, I don't want a full stiffy. You know what I'm saying? We're going with halfway broken in already. Okay. Binding color. Red. Oh, look at down here. Red steel. Yeah, we're going with the red steel for that bad boy on the binding. The crown. The crown color. So let's check that out. On the back, the little finger. White perforated. Oh, it's just like, just got holes in it. Uh, I guess that's good. Air out your fingers a little bit. Ain't nobody wants sweaty fingers. So let's, well, let's do that. Let's do white perforated for the, the crown. Okay, for the liner. White liner? I don't know. We'll go with red liner. That looks pretty good. So with our bench warmers team, we're sticking with like navy, red, and white. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of that's kind of our team colors here. So I don't know. I don't want to do too much red. Red looks pretty freaking cool though. But I think we'll try navy. We'll do. We'll go navy on the laces. I kind of like the snake skin. The snake skin's looking pretty sweet. Let me get some navy blue in there. Okay, the logo color. We got to do gold. We got to have some gold in there for the Short King's crown. Let's go. That's it. That's it right there. Gold logo. I feel like navy blue will be less noticeable when it comes to the wear and tear of it. You, uh, you know, the palm stain. The palm stain won't be as noticeable in a darker color. So we'll we'll put the palm navy blue in the stitching. Let's see. Flip this bad boy around. Red. That looks pretty cool. Gold. Look, they got rainbow down here. Ooh, look at that. I probably will be using this glove in June, so a little bit of rainbow wouldn't hurt. Ooh, damn. Look at that rainbow. Okay. That looks pretty freaking... The rainbow actually looks pretty dank, but I think we're going to have to go with gold. The gold just fits. Okay, and the web. I like the white. The white looks pretty good on the web right there. That looks pretty cool. The red, white, and blue action. America! America fuck yeah. Okay, moving on. Let's 
check out the welting. What kind of welting we got going on here? That's going to be what? The little stripes on the back of it? All right, let's see. Uh, too much blue on that one. Maybe red? I don't Maybe we should just go with the red steel. That's looking pretty legit. Look at that. The red steel popping off against the navy blue. That's what's up. That's looking funky fresh right there. The wingtip pinky. Let's see, what is that? The little piece over here? Why don't we throw some more red over there? Ooh, yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, and then the wingtip thumb. Let's check it out. Go over to the thumb right there. See, the white is looking pretty good. I think we'll go with that. Let's see, elephant skin, what? Ooh, that elephant skin. Look at that, that's looking pretty cool. I do kind of like the elephant skin. Imagine if it was real elephant skin. It'd be stiff as shit and like four inches thick. I think that would be illegal. I think we'll go with the white perforated. Get a little bit of that airflow, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody wants sweaty fingers. Okay, and that's it for that. That's pretty much all the colors. It's looking pretty slick, my guy. Looking pretty good. Now for the best part, to personalize it. Um, home plate logo. Probably not. Number, oh. Jumbo number, I think we'll go with that. Just a big number on the thumb there. 14, that's it. That is the number right there. I like the dark, it looks good. Dark right there, a little navy blue. Got the navy blue numbers. That looks pretty good right there. What's next, the palm stamp? That might be pretty cool. Let's try that out actually. Number 14, that's it. That is it, doggy. 14 in the palm. Thumb text, yep, let's get some names on there. Let's see, switch it back over to the thumb. Guess I'll just do my name here, huh? Gotta go with gold on this one. Ooh, yeah, the gold is looking good. I feel like my name's boring. I wanna spice it up a little bit more here. Why don't we do a uh, short king spring? What do you think? I'm gonna put what everybody's been calling me so far. Nicknames are not picked. They are given to you. Dirty Mike, that's me. That's what the homies have been calling me, so we're putting that bad boy on there. Your boy's always getting dirty. Dirty Mike it is, even though it's actually from that Will Ferrell movie. They even left you a note here. Thanks for the F-Shack. Love Dirty Mike and the boys. So for different reasons, but the reasoning I like to use is because I'm, I'm laying out getting dirty all the time. You feel me? Dirty Mike and the boys. That's what they say. That's looking pretty freaking good. Very flashy, but... When you're playing in a men's league, if you're not swagged up 24 seven, what's even the point? Index finger text? I don't really like how it's right on the welting. We'll have to save that one for a future project. Pinky text all the way over here. Eh, nah. Palm text, nah. Flag? Should I just do the freaking flag of Alabama just for shits and giggles? Yeah, I don't think we're gonna go with any flags. I think that's it. Look at that. She's a beaut. I would just have to say that. Put your tender care and love into this. That looks like a finished product. Ooh wee. Time to order it up. Let's go. Four to six weeks later. Okay. The mailman has arrived with my package. All right, here we are, the black bag. Handcrafted, custom handcrafted for Dirty Mike himself. Yes, thank you very much, yes. Let's check it. Look at that, there she is. Wow, look at that, what a beaut. What a beaut. Get this plastic off. Wowza, look at that. Oh, ain't she pretty. Wow. Ooh, very nice. Very good. Oh, it's very nice. Dirty Mike. They spelled it correctly. Very good. Very good. 
Take this little doohickey out. Cool. Funky fresh indeed. Look at that. That is that is good stuff right here. He like a glove. Oh yeah, this thing's stiff, alright. Pretty good. That looks pretty good. V Web. That modified V Web looking dank. That's what's up. <laughs> is the crown is visible the metallic red welting is looking pretty good on this bad boy so after everything i think this glove came out to like 197 after they had a a discount a holiday discount thing going so that's pretty good considering it's fully customized in the whole nine you know what i mean so you know you'd be paying at least double that for wilson rawlings custom glove so we're gonna break it in we're gonna test it out we're gonna see if it uh feels any worse i mean i have an a2000 that i've had forever so we'll see if this feels better or worse we'll see we will see um an update to come but this is what it looks like it turned out pretty good so yeah go order you one why not it's only 200 bucks with a discount you know go find a discount code somewhere Get yourself a customized glove. Why not? Uh, thanks for watching. One last look. There it is. An update to come.